Welcome to Weapons Education. This is going to be a fun channel update. I've been waiting for this one for a while. Yes, the Merchant website is live. We'll talk about that in a moment. Let me give you some updates, some other small things about our personal life. My wife is here. Honey, hello. Hi. Hello, everybody. We have a new addition to our family, don't we? We sure do. <laughs> now, she's been pushing to, for us to get a dog. I love dogs. I'm an animal lover. We already have a cat, Snow Meow. Mm -hmm. What kind of cat is she? Um, she's a miniature Persian. And she's all white with big blue eyes like yours, and she's just gorgeous, right? She's beautiful. Like this big. But she said she wants a dog, so I said, well, you know, I don't have enough firepower, really, sometimes to protect us. We'll talk about these HKs in a moment. So if we're going to get a dog, let's get something like a pit bull, Doberman, Rottweiler. I really, what I wanted was a German Shepherd, like a really good, strong police German Shepherd, like a 70-pound German Shepherd, because, you know, we're on the big property here, and like I said, I don't, I don't have enough firepower, these, you know, 100 plus guns, I ain't going to do it, all the, all the ARs and all that stuff, and, and all these Espadas we'll talk about in a moment. Sometimes you need a big dog. So I said, all right, all right, honey, right? Get a dog. But those are my choices. Pitbull, Rottweiler, German Shepherd, Doberman. <laughs> she goes, all right, I, I, I'm, I'll leave it up to you. But I want something that's going to be kind of really powerful. And protect watchdog. our home. A watchdog. A watchdog. Yeah, yeah. So here, here's the unveiling of the new addition to our family. It's a female, so we just called her Winter because she's white. You ready? <laughs> Now this this dog has some is going to grow up to be a really brutal attack dog, and if anyone tries to get on my property with this dog, I'll tell you right now, you're in trouble. <laughs> Here it comes. Oh, I gotta hand it to my wife. Oh, okay. Oh, so much. She's heavy. Oh, weighing in at one ounce. <laughs> Oh, one pound. She's going to fall off. I'm sure she's going to fall off. Look, look at this thing. So explain to everyone, what is this little beautiful puppy? What is she's, it? She's a micro teacup Pomeranian, and she's a little less than a pound now. Um, full grown, she'll be two, two Heavy, and a half pounds. <laughs> it's full grown, she'll be what? Two to two and a half pounds. Mm. So she's, okay, look at that little here. tail. She's so cute. Let me see something here. Okay, she's a... Uh, you know, I'm into dimensions. She's six inches by ten inches, and she weighs a whopping one pound. <laughs> and she'll be, when she's full grown, how many pounds? Uh, between two to two and a half pounds. Oh, gosh. So, she's... so don't attack my home. <laughs> <laughs> or anywhere you take her. <laughs> she's she looks cute. Like a I gotta give you credit. Show. I do. I, I love her. And she's soft as silk, and she's calm and pleasant. And look, she's licking me. Yeah, she doesn't bark. She's actually, yeah, she's a mute, she's, right? <laughs> She'll bark the when she, she gets She a little bit, but she's... <laughs> mm, she's sweet. So All right, sweet. so that's the new addition to our family. And we're, we're going to do a lot of videos on this when my wife gets on, on camera. And this will be her thing to talk about the dog. Congratulations. I'm, I'm happy for you, honey. I'm glad you picked this dog. And Thank it you. came from the other side of the world. Far away. We'll talk about that and next time. But yeah, she came from California, very far. And then it flew from California to here. I think this thing took like a week to get, but uh, this beautiful puppy. How old is she? Um, four and a half months. May first. And she's only a pound still. Yeah, she's. And she's eating and she's healthy. Five pounds. Yeah, she's doing great. Yeah. Show her sideways how cute she is. So <laughs> cute. <laughs> and she runs and plays right. and. I'll, I'll put it so back cute. in our cage. Let's talk about some other stuff. All right, so that's my uh, pit bull. I love pit bulls. And ch I had a lot of chows. I wanted a chow. but I well, She looks like a miniature chow. And what kind of dog is it again? Say exactly. She's, she's a Pomeranian. And, but a, a mi micro? Micro teacup Pomeranian. A micro that's what they called her, yes. Micro teacup. Well, and they two and a half pounds. Okay. Yeah, All right, so three... not much poop, right? No. <laughs> the size the of a poops quarter. are like rabbit balls. Quarter. <laughs> <laughs> it's important. All right, let's move along here. 
Uh, all right, let's see what else is going on. Uh, I'm going to Pennsylvania Friday. This is being recorded on uh, Wednesday. Uh, the day after tomorrow, I'm flying to see Pete at the Armory Channel. And I'm picking up a Desert Eagle. Yes, it's a 50 AE. I know a lot of you said they get the 44 or the 357. But the reason why I'm getting this particular one is because I just, you know, I have a large arsenal. And I just like something different. And the reason why I'm getting gold is not to be gaudy, but it's just something different. It's just something different for my collection, for my heirloom, for my family, for my children someday or whatever. I just, I like something different. And I'm really not a gaudy person, but I've seen it in person uh, at a local gun shop in Florida. And why am I buying it in Pennsylvania? Because that question always comes up. It's because I'm supporting a really good person at a local gun shop up there. I'm fixing my shirt here. I'm supporting a good gun shop up there, and it's Pete's buddy. So, no big deal. You, by the way, when you buy a gun out of state and you have your concealed weapons permit, all you do is you fly to that state, like, I'm, like I did when I Cabela's when I bought my Ed Brown 1911. I flew to Cabela's. I paid for it. They want their money. They pay for it, whatever the price is, you know. And then you uh, do your paperwork when you receive it. So then they send it to the FFL here in Florida, and then I go to the FFL, oh there it is, and I pay the shipping, and I pay the transfer fees, whatever it is, and I just show my credentials, and I fill out the form in Florida, and I take my gun home. And then Pete and I get to do a video together. That's part of it also, because you know, Pete's such a good soul, and I'm uh, looking forward to seeing him the day after tomorrow. I'm flying, I uh, land around 3 p.m. Friday, and then we're going to go zoom to the gun shop, and we're going to grab it, we're going to make a video, and, and then we're going to... The Pipple's making some noise there. <laughs> That's the first time I heard it. That's the first time. <laughs> she likes listening to you. <laughs> then we're going to grab the gun, and we're going to do a video, and we're going to ship it uh, to my FFL. And then when I get back, then we'll do some cool uh, videos on that. 50 AE, Desert Eagle, brand new, gold, really beautiful gun. And it's just a, collect, a collector's item. But I actually, I, I use my guns. We're going to shoot it. We're going to break it down. We're going to talk about it. And I'm going to make, you know, I know it's overloaded to carry. I'm not a Rambo. But I'm going to get a holster for it. Talking about holsters, as we know the website's open. I highly, highly recommend that you go to the custom holsters. They're about the same price as Galco. And I don't care which one you purchase. This dog's never made a word in her life. Now she's, <laughs> no. now she's making noises. I have no idea. <laughs> that were her, she her really whole two-day life with us. I know. That's she the really first time she's made a noise. Listen, let me get back on track here. I recommend you get the custom holsters because they're, in my opinion, I love Galco. I'm a deal with Galco. They're either comparable or better. So I can't say you know, anything else but that. I would go with custom because... I, it's custom and it's thick gauge leather and I don't care what gun you have, we can make a, a holster for a knife if you want. Anything you want. Handmade, thick stitched, double stitched, really awesome. And talk to anybody who's already purchased, anyone, by the way, anyone who's purchased one of these custom holsters, leave a message on my main page as to how you like that holster you bought from me because we sold a dozen or so already. And the store opened last night without me even announcing it. We sold, what, 70, 80 products last night. So yeah, thank you so much. The YouTube discount code. I'm trying to remember everything to say right now. The YouTube discount code is Weapons Ed. This is for the subscribers. Weapons Ed. And that's it. All lowercase. And then you get 10% off everything on the store. Now, if you want to buy something special like a pricey knife like this, my favorite knife in the world. Uh, you know, it's four hundred something dollars. PM me, and I'll work a deal with you. Cause you know, I want I want to cut you a good deal on pricey stuff. Stuff you know, two, three, four hundred bucks. PM me what your phone number. Say, Tom, I'm serious. I have a credit card, debit card, whatever it is. Can I save more than ten percent? The answer is yes. Don't do it on t-shirts or the normal little stuff, but on pricey stuff, the answer is yes. PM me. We'll talk on the phone. I've already done like 100 transactions over the phone. Everything's silky smooth. We shipped out six cases of Ballastol today. Lickety split. Perfect. I already got a new order of Ballastol in. We're good to go. 
Let's look at the t-shirts because one of the things, if you really want to help the channel, please take a close, nice, beautiful zoom. I'm very proud of these shirts. And everyone who has received them, the first 300 sold out. Now I have my second batch of 300 shirts in stock, all sizes from small to, to triple XL. Everyone who has received the shirt are happy. I have 100% positive responses. As a matter of fact, people who have received them immediately call back and says, I want one for my friend or spouse or somebody else. So if there's one thing you want to do to support the channel, I'm asking you to click on one of my shirts and buy it. Because that, the, whatever little couple of bucks I make, because I put, I don't know how much money, into the logo, design, the graphics, and five colors and layers and layers and layers. I'm in the hole, you know, until for, for about a year with this site, but whatever. But I'm saying whatever a couple of bucks comes in goes back towards all of this, goes back towards the motivation Money goes to Pete, a couple of bucks, and, and it helps all of us. And it just helps the gun community. It helps me fight gun laws. Which, by the way, tomorrow night is going to be one of my important videos because tomorrow's Thursday night, and I'm going to do a video on gun laws in particular because that'll be my last video until I come back on Tuesday. We'll get the Desert Eagle video at Pete's house. I don't know if I'll put it on my channel or his. We'll figure that out. But, but tomorrow night's video is important for my channel. And it's going to be about gun laws. So, with a couple of bucks I make on shirts, you know, whatever it is, it all goes into me in, the, in these flights, flying to Pennsylvania, flying to Virginia, to the NRA Museum, like I did, and all, and all the different type of radio stations I'm doing. If you want to support me, the shirts is one way to do it. And tomorrow night, I'll tell you how else to support me as far as finding gun laws because I got a lot of things planned. We're going to change stuff. We're going to change gun laws and. And I, I love the fact that everyone's behind me. That just it just gets me it gets me all wound up. All right. So the store, by the way, I said Weapons Ed. That's a ten percent discount. That's the coupon code. Use that if you want to spend some serious cash and buy some pricey products. PM me with your phone number. We'll work a deal. And I'll make I, I want to make you happy. Some of you know you you bought some stuff and I threw some goodies in there. I'm, I'm all about just giving back. It's all about giving back. I'm going to end this video, by the way, with some uh, one little small short life lesson, uh, like I normally do with a channel update. But here, before I do that, back I'll next say week, I'm going to do. We've got a nice look at those. A video on HK, the P2000 SK, the smaller version, and the HK P2000, the larger version, the 40. Okay, so. Uh, just keep a lookout for that next week and let me know if you were to buy either one of these here's the question which one would you buy the smaller one or the bigger one and I'll tell you my impression next week HK in my opinion is really one of the best manufacturers of handguns in the world I like German quality as you know it I like American quality I like them all otherwise I wouldn't have purchased it and, and let me answer, answer this while I got everybody. Everyone's saying, uh, can you do a review on this, that, and the other. Beretta, I have to buy a Beretta to do a review on it. I have to buy a Benelli to do a review on it. So yes, I will, in time. But I can't just go buy, you know, 100 guns just to do videos on them. It has to be, it has to be comfortable with me and make sure, you know, I, I love Beretta and I love Benelli and we're going to do that. And all of your comments on my shotgun video gave me some good tips and that's now you're going to cost me to buy a Benelli, that's my next shotgun. I'm just going to keep that Mossberg 500 the way it is, that's pistol grip like you said, a lot of good comments and that's the end of that. But my next shotgun will be a Benelli and my next um, my next pistol besides the Desert Eagle will be a Beretta. Okay, But uh, let's talk about HK, think about which HK you would purchase, uh, the full size um, on, the, on this one here or the smaller size here. I like them both and we'll do a complete detailed comparison next week. It's just nice that you know I, I kind of happen to have them. The other thing is do this I'm just thinking I've been off the cuff and this is this is something everyone's asking about my watches and um, how many we got what 10 12 nice watches and, and that's not boasting or goofy stuff. But since you're asking, and since I had such an overwhelming response, please zoom in on this very, very, very close. As without blurring it, please kindly. This is a yacht master, and I am not the watch guru, 
but I will show you our collection as I promised. Uh, this is 18 karat gold, a mother of pearl with diamonds. It's uh, something I've always wanted since a child, and when I do my watch video, you can pan back up now. I'm going to show you about 10 or 12 watches of this caliber, uh, including your platinum watches and things like that, honey, and even your wedding ring, which is which is just it's just it's just what's the word flabbergasting? It's, what, what's your word for it? Oh, it's gorgeous. I love gorgeous. It. That's a good word. And you got two wedding rings: the one you wear every day and the one we keep in the bank in the vault. So. But, all right, there you have it. So, please support the channel. Please go to the site. If you like what you see, cool. Buy something. If you don't like it, that's cool, too. It's, it's no sweat. But just, the main thing is, this is a, a firearms channel, a knife channel. We're going to be talking a lot about knives now, now that the channel, the merchant website's up. A lot about you knife enthusiasts. Because i got over about 100 of these puppies, at least. Maybe 100, I don't even know. i got two safes full of them. So we'll be talking about a lot about knives, and it just motivates me to do more videos. Your kindness, your support is what motivates me. Let me end that because I'm getting long-winded here with some life advice. And I don't want to be sad or anything right now. And I, you know, here's the Bible, and then, you know I'm spiritual and all that. But we lost two YouTubers to suicide in the last six months. Two subscribers of mine, and particularly Pete's, who he was very close friends with, and he spoke to. Okay, that's that. The point is, life is difficult right now for a lot of people, you know, including us, right? Honey, right? We got, sure. We got problems. Everyone does. No one's perfect, right? We have stress. We have issues with the business, right? Is, that, has, is the business the same now as it was in 05? I'm being real. Is it? No. Yes or no? Not at all. No. Not at all. In 08, did that crash hurt us? Yes? Sure. Yes. Sure. What did we do? We had issues. We, we, I pulled my bootstraps up, and I'm not saying I'm righteous or I'm perfect or anything. I'm just saying this, this is my point. For those of you who are in a state of shock, depression, particularly depression, there's way too many people who are doing some drastic things right now. Whether you go to spirituality, whether you you got to do something. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. you got to do something to get some help. If your parents aren't the people to go to to get help, go to go Google online. I have this problem. Whatever it is. Alcoholism. I don't know. Whatever it is. Whatever it is. Depression. Uh, people thinking about suicide. Very, 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 very sad. Young people are very emotional. And, and I'm going to talk openly here with my wife. When we were young, and I didn't know you when you were 17, 16, but if, if a boyfriend broke up with you, was it brutal? Sure, we were just talking about that, sure. Yeah, I mean, so I was never suicidal. But, but I know that, but I'm but, just saying, we were just emotional. And sure. And do you remember those children. things now? No. <laughs> no. It's so silly looking back, right? <laughs> no, it is. It's really silly. And But at that time, you know, a lot of people... It's not silly for them. It's not silly for them. Right. But I'm not, I, 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 I want to give them strength, and that's the sure. whole idea of this message. If you're down and out in your life, seek support. Call a helpline. Go to your parents, and if your parents aren't the answer, go to your counselor at school. If you're in the military, talk to somebody. Whatever your situation is, go to your friends and say, listen, this is my situation. I'm really down and out. Because I promise you, It'll pass. You won't remember it. Life is awesome. Just to breathe and wake up and get up and jump out of bed and be able to see the sunrise. I'm doing a special video of the ocean. I'm going to go to the ocean in a couple of weeks and just, I'm going to get up at 4 a.m. and go there and just watch the sunrise. And I'm not going to say a word and just, just watch the sunrise. What a beautiful thing it is to be alive. So just, that's that my little message. Just, you know, just get support if you need help. And if you need help, you can PM me and I'll call you. I promise. I've called hundreds of people in the past month. I enjoy it. I'm there for you. I'm not, I'm not a psychiatrist or psychologist or any of that stuff. And, but I do seem to have an uplifting response to people when they, when they call me. They, 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 they respond to me well. And I really get some good feedback from the phone conversations. So I'm just saying, if you're down and out, I'm there for you. 
I care about everybody. I'm going to check out. Tomorrow night's video is going to be on gun rights. That's an important one. We're going to fight gun laws. That's what this channel is all about. Firearms and gun laws. I'm going to tell you a cool story of what the NRA did to save uh, someone from going to jail because he protected himself in his home and, and had to take out two bad guys. Checking out. You know how much I care about all of you. Bye-bye.